we always want to be able to play our five essential open chords, E major, A major, D major, G major, and C major, one after the other. Okay, that means like D to A and A to D and A to G and G to C and C to G and back and forth. Uh, so we get our fingers in the same positions every time. And in the case of the first E, A, D sequence, we're pivoting off our first finger on the third string of the second fret, lifting our two other fingers, okay? We wanna have those shapes stay consistent when we do our G and C major, all right? And then how we're gonna learn this the best way is to take a song like Love Me Do or Rain from the Beatles and, you know, work out those chords, the A to D or G to C in some of these songs, okay? So this is the best way to do it. Um, it's going to take you a little time to be able to go between each of these chords, but you will be able to do it. Um, I think in about by the 30th or 50th time, your fingers go to those positions that you'll actually feel more comfortable. Um, okay, every single time. It should get better. Great.